Hello viewers, in this section, we are going to learn about how to read CSV file. I mean the comma separated file using Apache 3.x to Java. I am going to create a simple Java program. New data set. Read CSV. To create a simple method. Create a Spark session. And it master as a local with app name as a CSV or start here. Now I'm going to now we have created this box session. I'm going to read by box session dot sql context dot a dot format. We have to use the library from the data fix and which is located in com dot data fix dot spark dot csv dot load so we supposed to see where the file is located now i'm going to get the file path class dot get resource i'm going to read the sample underscore csv dot csv get part let define the file path here that's it now we have to assign it to the data set so it will be in pro format value okay, for this let's see all the values in the data set Make it as well. Name information better. Now say dot show. Now let we should see all this data in the console. See now it's not building. Yeah, it started running. Let's see that output. So here you can see that first row is C1, C2, C3, up to C6, and the second row is comma separated file bin start lambda, and the last one is football cricket. Okay, so here we can see there is no header. So that the headers, so if we not define the headers, the spark automatically will define underscore C0 underscore C1, something like if you want to define. The first two row as a header listen you know so we have to do there is a function there is a option function here we have to define header as a true if we define this option header as a true what the spark will do it will assume the first two row as a header let's see that output Now you can see that you know, C1, C2 are the first the row is a header, and he, now the first row is common separated, sorry, comma separated files instead. Okay, and also the next thing would like to share. So here you know, so the development, so the most of the values got truncated. You mean here. So there are one, two, three, four development, but I, we could see only only one. 
<coughs> it's due to the show method will truncate automatically by default the show method is i uh, will assign the true and if you make it as a false we can see that entire value so now i make it as a false and i'm going to run let's see So now you can see like no, so there are one, two, three, four development is there. So the complete data is there. One, two, three, four is there. So if you want to do any kind of debug, if you want to show the entire data, you have to make the truncate as a false. If you make it as a true, it will get truncated and the true is default one. So if you have any doubts or clarification, please post it in the command section. Thanks for watching.